Hello and welcome back to The Medium, episode number 4. We are starting off right where we left. In case you don't remember, we've just been hunted by a huge monster, which was amazing. Oh no, he's not gone yet. Oh, I sn sneaking, really? Turns into Metal Gear Solid suddenly. Where is she? Oh. Go back, go back, go back. I don't know the mechanics yet, how the AI is gonna react to me sneaking. How much to what I can get away with, basically. I can't see anything. I'd be your friend if you wouldn't try to fucking kill me. No, no. I'm so so Turn the other way. Your hands are so weird. Try you on, that is such a weird. I move so slowly, it's unbelievable. Nope, 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 nope. <clears throat> Come on, which way are you gonna turn? Hoping you would turn that way. I don't want to try to run because that would probably give away my position. I'm so glad I turned left here and not right. Fuck, 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 fuck. I am not fast enough to outrun you. In sneak mode, I mean. I mean, there's light here, I could probably run for it, but I don't want to try. Holy shit. What or who is this guy? I wonder where I am in the real world, actually. What the fuck was that? Thank you. Exactly the question I want to know. I wonder if the little girl that has ever met this guy. Don't fall. Oh, this is a cutscene. I can't do anything right now. She gonna scare me and I'm gonna fall. I would not be surprised. Most people spend their whole lives seeing only a fraction of our reality. Lucky them. I 
I have spent my whole life looking beyond the edges of our reality. Even as a child, I saw things that would break a grown man. Eventually, I grew into it. It became my normal. But that thing, it was anything but normal. I've never encountered anything like this. This ravenous. I felt lost. I came to Neva looking for answers and all I got was more questions. What was that monster? Who was Thomas? And what did he want from me? I woke up with icy water in my veins. I wanted nothing but to get out of there. To just get up and run until my legs give out, until my lungs collapse. But I knew I couldn't. It wouldn't have solved anything. And besides, sadness needed my help. Great, now it's dark There's and we're still there. here. That's just terrible. Merry and happy. You're okay. Sadness? Holy Is that shit. You? Are you okay? What was that thing? Hello? Fine. Richard. Richard? No, Sadness. The man I'm looking for is named Thomas. Who's Richard? He's in the day room. Day room? What the hell is a day Are you room? To show me the way? I still have nothing to get through here, right? No. All right. What's the shot? Don't know if that is glass or uh, another room. Okay, what is a day room supposed to be? Like a sun room? I mean, the, f the light's flashing here, so I assume something is... Day room, seven. So it's off the main thing here. Here, so it's... Okay, I think I know where it roughly is. Oops, wrong button. It's the same as before, right? Yeah. So it should be in this direction. Down here. Whoa. Okay. Such automatic doors were not a thing. That time. So that was definitely ghost activity. Ghost. Alright. What now? I mean, you can't get through the metal chain, okay, but the wood of that door has to be pretty weak by now, right? Anything here? No. Yep, 
this isn't weird at all. Kind of glad I, fo I found that flashlight. I keep seeing it in my dreams. The other place. Dust and death as far as the eye can see. A feeling of nothingness tearing at my soul. I wake up choking. Feeling the dust burning through my lungs. I beg for it to stop. He says there's no helping it. Then again, he would say that, wouldn't he? I like this little diary outputs, I think. I don't know. Family time, holidays in the country. Yet this doesn't look horrible at all. A light here in the background. Can't go anywhere here. Okay. First to Thomas, then Richard. Before I knew it, I was looking for a bunch of strangers. <laughs> That's true. At least sadness was still with me. Yeah, well. In a way. Don't know if I can trust her. Ooh. That like the swimming pool. Swimming pool in a horror game is never a good idea. Of course I have to go down. I assume the double reality thing is gonna start again soon. Whoa, holy fucking shit. Is that? Oh no, it is. It's everywhere. Yeah, it's paint. People died here. That's not the question. The question is not how many people died here, the question is how the fuck did they die that their blood ends up on the wall? <sighs> if this is like a hotel, there might be many old people that die in their sleep in the rooms, but not like there's blood on the wall. Should I try to go down? Can I even try? I can't, right? Okay, I thought maybe I could try going down there. I assume I will somehow get down there. Or be thrown down there. It's gotta be... Oh, not yet. Let me walk a little more. Okay, I have more than one option to go down. That's interesting. That blood on the floor and on the walls, even more. I mean, holy shit. I mean, look at that. Look at the floor. Uh, this means either police or military or something. Did someone get crushed here by this, or what the fuck happened? The nurse. She did it. She killed them all. It was like something possessed her. Is that really what you want us to put on record? It's what I saw. The nurse. But... How? Why? Yeah, how? How is a good question. More blood here, Jesus Christ. I can go down. Should I go down or should I go into the other room? Let's just try and go down. Yeah, nothing to look at here. Oh, inside. I'm a dumbass. Let me be frank. This case is problematic. My superiors wanted to go away. I wanted to go. You can see how your statement complicates that? Comrade? I... Yes, I understand. Some things don't just go away. They stick. They echo. So did they basically try to cover it up? Just because they didn't want to, you know, worry about the paperwork? 
Yeah, that's, that seems legit. I mean, whoa, Jesus Christ, it's even more. How many people died here? Yeah, this doesn't look terrifying at all. Jesus Christ, this is freaking me out. I couldn't be in that place at night. I just I would curl up into a corner and probably go insane. Just going into the next dark room would be fucking impossible for me. And there's more blood. Fucking hell. Yay. So why did I put that here? I mean... Wait, do I have to put it the other way? Can I... Okay, I can't put it anywhere else, so... Don't know why I, still can, why I can still touch it. Don't know what the point was. But whatever. Try not to look at him. The sooner we're done, the sooner we can get out of this place. Oh, definitely didn't need to feel that. Cops looking at the corpses, I assume. Jesus. Yeah, more blood. I mean, how powerful was this woman? My dearest, I wish this was it. The moment I plucked, uh, pluck up the courage and actually send this one. Seems so easy, just throw it in the mailbox. Then why can't I? Someday, I promise. I love you with all my heart. F. So what, did he or she just write these? He, I assume, because the recipient is a woman? And just never sent them? <laughs> <clears throat> oh, F is Francis. Okay, Francis. What am I supposed to do with you? Once Niva shut down, you begged me to keep you on, said you needed time to sort things out, said you could be useful. But now I know you're just using me as an excuse. Like those letters you keep writing. I know you never sent a single goddamn one. Family is doing good, Mr. Rakovich. I'll probably go home this next spring, summer at the latest. Who are you kidding, Frank? Hell, as long as you're here, I can at least keep an eye on you. Make sure you don't get hammered and pass out in the snowdrift. Guess it's the least I can do. Good old Frank. Too scared to live, too stubborn to die. Sometimes I feel guilty using you like this. But then I remember I need all the help I can get. So, is Thomas Rekovich and the Frank guy were here maybe alone even? Oh wait, this is where I came out. feels like a room I can run, this feels like a hallway I should run away from something, right? Locked. Damn it. 
Okay. Hold on. Let me just for the giggles turn on ray tracing. Look at that again. Yeah, you see the difference. And in that puddle, I mean, definitely see the difference. But you definitely feel the difference in the performance as well. Damn it. Maybe I'll try something else to turn it down, but to keep ray tracing on. Maybe I'll just turn down the resolution. Maybe I won't do this in 4K anymore. Maybe I'll go back to 1080p and have everything else at high. Kind of play around with the, the performance options. Hey, Marianne. You look like shit. <laughs> okay. Now I want to turn it on. Ray tracing on. I don't think there's a difference this time. I mean, it, don't get me wrong, it looks good. I mean, the reflection doesn't look all that insanely amazing. But the rest of the game just details, 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 there's so much of it. Let me guess, another locked door. Of course. Isn't that where I jumped down? Where am I? Are those bolt cutters? That might be useful. <coughs> if only I could reach them. How do I get these? Hmm. Can I not just climb up there? Hmm. Whoa. Whoa. Sadness? How did you... My reflection oh, is shit. also different now. Well, that's my seven years bad luck. That is so cool. Oh, hold on. Didn't even see there was a door here. Jesus Christ. <laughs> That sounded... that didn't sound like sadness, laughing. It sounded like a boy. Hey! Wait up! Come on, Slowpoke! I've got an idea. We're gonna show that weirdo. What... what are you gonna do? Hmm. There were some kids here. Yeah, it sounds like two bullies, at least two bullies, and I assume that weirdo they're talking about is gonna be sadness. And that's probably why she was sad. Hello? Anyone? Jesus Christ. Now I'm here again. It's not where I wanted to go. Oh, I'm gonna have to go up here, aren't I? Climb up here so I can get over there to the bolt cutters. Hold on. Did I miss something? Yes, I did. Yeah, that's sadness. And I assume that was hers. Oh, spirit trail, I forgot about that. Sorry. Come on, hurry. Why is it going in this direction? Oh, there's something on the floor here. I didn't see that. Damn it, I'm a blind... Blind monkey, am I? Yeah, just... Sorry. What? No. It's fine. 
I'm sure they're here somewhere. No, no. Bernard wouldn't do that. He's nice. Oh, she's talking to herself again. What a freak. Hey, don't talk about her like that. Yeah, sounds like a very bad bullying situation. Mm. Oh, we go down, maybe? tank. First hand. I know that all too well. I'm going through all over again. This time with spirit help. What is it? You want to show me something? Obviously. What the hell? So what if I tried spirit, uh, the spirit instinct thing the first time I went through here? Would I have not had to do that? Snowdrop, huh? Why does that sound familiar? Cute cat. It looked back at me. Oh god, this is not oh. weird at all. Wow. I assumed... Uh, something with the mirror is gonna go terrible. Oh, yeah, I've seen that. Um, did I miss something? Why is that still here? I've done everything here. Hmm. What it says, follow the spirit trail. Is it gone now? Okay. Hold on. No, it's not. It's still here. Oh, read. It looked back at me. Okay. Why is that not going away? Because there's nothing for me to find here. No, no I've done that already. I hear bad sounds. I felt a slight tug in my pocket. I could tell there was more to that figurine than just carved wood. Oh no. Something bad's gonna happen. I can feel it calling out to me. The Oh, the chain's on the other side. Okay, I thought the chain was gone for a second. It looked back at me, huh?
it was the first time that it ever happened. I touched the mirror and crossed over to the other side. place and this is where i will leave this episode uh, thank you very much for watching um join me next time because i really want to know how it continues my name is oliver here at vienna gamer and thank you for watching